Hello from 3D Organon, and another warm welcome to you all for being with us today for our webinar on um, 3D Organ Anatomy, Desktop and Tablet um, Functions and Features. I'm Theo Zuriyanis, Sales Manager at 3D Organon for Europe, the Middle East, and Africa. And once again, I shall be your host for today's webinar. So let's get started. This is a third webinar in the series of 3D Organon webinars designed to give you a comprehensive and concise view of the 3D Organon Anatomy software solutions. In today's webinar, we will explore all those exciting functions, features, and tools that make the 3D Organon Anatomy software for desktop and mobile devices a most effective and valuable resource for teaching and self-directed learning of anatomy. All videos used in today's webinar are uploaded on our YouTube channel, so don't worry if you feel you've missed anything. Um, it's fine. The 3D Organ on Cutting Edge Medical Anatomy Platform provides two, the, <clears throat> two applications. 3D Anatomy, which is designed to be used with desktop, laptop, and tablet mobile devices. And of course, Virtual Reality Anatomy, which is designed to support PC-powered VR headsets and standalone VR headsets. For more details uh, referring to um, virtual reality anatomy, you can always um, revert back to our previous um, webinar. 3D Organ on Medis Media is a multi-award winning software development company that specializes in medical and healthcare education. We are proud to inform you that 3D Organon is also the winner of the prestigious EdTech 2021 awards for the best virtual and augmented educational solutions. More recently was awarded the Muse Creative Award 2021 in the Experimental and Immersive Virtual Reality Projects category among 4,876 entries from all over the world. That's amazing. And just a few weeks ago, the Impact Bytes Awards 2021. 3D Organon is the leading extended reality anatomy platform and is the first and most advanced VR anatomy solution for medical education worldwide. 3D Organon has a multimodal approach to teaching and learning of anatomy. The content of 3D Organon anatomy software, which has been designed and created by anatomist professors and medical professionals, is original and based on extensive research led investigation of scientific literature. This software application contains high detail 3D models and 3D organ anatomy incorporates fundamentals like engagement, enjoyment, interactivity and motivation, all leading to a high degree of knowledge comprehension and retention. The extensive knowledge base of anatomical terminology and definitions in the software application is translated in an unprecedented 16 languages. Dutch is the latest language to be included in the 2022 release to be out shortly. 3D Organon is available across different devices for multimodal anatomy teaching and learning and offers cross-platform support. The educator can use the desktop version to prepare slides that explain anatomy effectively and efficiently, either in the class, in a tutorial or the lecture theater. He or she, can connect the desktop computer to a presentation board or share the screen via collaboration platform. Students can access the whole database of 3D models, images, animations, formative assessments, definitions, and much, much more either at the institution or even conduct self-directed learning at home. With the application for tablet and smartphone, you are literally on the go. It allows you to review the anatomy content and material anywhere and anytime needed. Our mobile and tablet software has integrated augmented reality, AR, as you might know it, where anatomy is superimposed onto your real environment. Let's not forget uh, PC-powered VR and standalone VR. Just to mention those as a reminder. 3D Organon is a cross-platform application that supports and covers everything from Windows, Mac operating system, iOS, and Android. And of course, as a slight mention, we also, we also support all the major VR headsets in the, world, in the market worldwide. 3D Organon offers intuitive future-proof software solutions to suit the next generation of learners and educators 
with a platform for teaching and learning anatomy applications. Let's explore the next the, the digital solutions on desktop, laptop, and tablet mobile that 3D Organon brings to the new generation learner. Explore 15 body systems, including over 10,000 realistic anatomical structures. Hopefully we'll start. Yes, that's a 2021 desktop edition with 15 body systems and with 10,000 realistic anatomical structures. 16 languages to choose from. The bone mapping module of each bone organized the parts, borders, surfaces, and landmarks. A detailed heart model. Hundreds of cadaveric images related to the selected body system. A drawing tool to sketch meaningful explanations for students laid on top of 3D models. A slicing tool, section the 3D model from any angle you want in real time. The microscopic anatomy module, absolutely amazing, breathtaking. We'll see more of that later on. The growth tool, the bone spurs tool, the pain tool, topographic anatomy, of course, the amazing multi selection feature, an x ray mode body actions module and the formative assessment quizzes. We shall all see those in detail as later further on um, in, the, in the webinar. 3D Organ on Anatomy provides a wide range of use case scenarios and allows you to use the most appropriate scenario based on your resources and curriculum or course requirements. The student can use 3D organ anatomy software for self-directed learning to tutor oneself, demonstrate, understand, and learn anatomy. You can use a desktop or tablet, and of course a VR headset, just a slight reminder there, and also project the content on a second screen or wall projector. In a small room with one or two or three students, for example, 3D organ anatomy software can easily and effectively fit the purpose of student or educator-led small group teaching. A desktop, laptop, mobile, or even tablet fits well with the purpose. In an educator-led large group, the lecturer can present the anatomy class in a large group session or in a lecture theater. Again, they can use his desktop. An educator may use the desktop or tablet version and the VR version, of course, of 3D Organon to run an online multi-user cross-platform session with students being able to join from institutional or their own devices. Here, in the, here the professor has opted to use the multi-user cross-platform session with a desktop PC to deliver his anatomy in-class session to his students who are using standalone VR headsets. With a multi-user cross-platform, you can enable interstate and even overseas students to experience the tangible benefits of 3D technologies via online classrooms where anatomy is demonstrated live and students, of course, are able to explore with cross-platform device support. 3D organ anatomy can be implemented on unit, can be implemented, sorry, on university library desktop workstations as a great source for anatomy learning for, for students and their self-directed study. Museums are also rapidly employing 3D organon to enhance their exhibit portfolios. And once again, uh, desktop workstations fit nicely for this purpose. 3D organ anatomy is empowering patient-centered education by helping doctors visually explain the appearance, the, the appearance, position, and relationships of body structures to patients. Again, here you can be using a, a desktop, a laptop, a, a tablet, even a mobile, and of course, a VR headset. The 3D organ can be effectively used by surgical trainees and surgeons for surgical training and planning in order to revise the anatomy of the area or to plan and revise the procedural steps. Using 3D organ anatomy for surgical planning and training offers a safe learning environment and can even be conducted remotely, which is less time consuming and more, more cost effective. In an anatomy lab during cadaver dissection, Groups of students can be working at different desktop workstations or with a tablet 
next to cadaveric dissection tables. Of course, we have formative assessment. We'll see more of that as we later on. And with desktop or laptop, you can use 3D organ anatomy for your clinical skill sessions, revise anatomy before and during physical examination workshops, and demonstrate surface anatomy. Welcome to the 3D organ on anatomy environment on desktop or lap laptop. The left column includes illustrated icons that represent the following features and, and, and functions. Menu, network, topographic anatomy, diagram, regional anatomy, actions, quiz, the search feature, the multi-select feature, the tools, reset, views. And, on, and while the right column includes the system-based anatomy, with all 15 body systems illustrated with the representative, representative um, icons, heart, digestive, um, endocrine. Here we can show, we're showing some indicative uh, movements. You can, of positioning your model as desired at the right angle. You can pan it, you can zoom it. as desired, whatever fits the purpose of your um, teaching session or your self-directed learning. Here he is from close up. Um, before we move on, um, there were two things we want to mention. First, that you can all, you, um, there's the gender selection feature that, at the bottom right hand corner, you can, where you can um, select your, uh, the gender and you can switch between multiple workstations by simply reflecting, selecting, sorry, a holding number, one, two, three at the bottom of the right side panel, as you can see. With this feature, you can jump between three different scene screens of 3D models for super fast access and allow for a smooth transition between related body regions during teaching or self-directed learning. Multiple, this is amazing when you're teaching. Multiple workstations, workspaces, sorry, are available in desktop and tablet solutions. Let's take a look at the menu feature. With the full screen menu selection, you can span out the 3D organ on app window to all your desktop or lap to the entire desktop or laptop screen. In the environment, you can choose the background that suits your teaching or learning style better by switching between light and dark. You can select a primary language and secondary language, so you can have two languages simultaneously. This is an attractive and effective feature for institutions that conduct courses in more than one language and also for the international students at your institution. And here's the help function, which contains a menu of comprehensive short videos that provide guidance and help on how to use the features and functions of the software applications on your desktop and mobile devices. I would like to mention here, of course, that apart from the help, help function, we are always readily available to provide demos, training um, courses as part of our after sales support. So you, you need not worry. The network feature enables educators to host immersive real-time virtual rooms to suit on-campus or remote delivery of anatomy teaching. By creating an immersive real-time virtual room, the educator can have a multi-user cross-platform session with students able to join from institutional devices or their own devices. That means any desktop, laptop, tablet, mobile device, and any type of VR headset from any location. This allows them to follow an online remote or in-class anatomy session in real time. In the, at the right there, you can see the number of participants and you can also use the microphone to voice chat or to, uh, to write text. During the pandemic lockdown, the multi-user cross-platform literally, and I kid you not, saved the day for institutions around the world by allowing them to continue delivering their courses and serve the curriculum. That was very important and vital. The system-based anatomy approach in 3D Organon is designed to provide learners with the big picture of a single body system. By adding or removing body systems on the anatomy model, students can or, or the educator can develop a thorough understanding of anatomical correlations and positioning. As you see, on the right side panel, you can add and subtract whole body systems in your scene view with a single click. 
Here we're adding, for example, the digest, we've done the heart, the respiratory, the, the digestive, endocrine, sensory. Then you can, um, muscles can be exposed in layers from deep to superficial and vice versa, just simply by adding layers and subtracting la layers. We can change, we can add the skin, we can change the gender. Here again, see we're, we're removing um, muscle layers. Absolutely amazing. With the topographic anatomy module, you can teach surface anatomy, emphasize structures of a region, show the relationships between anatomical structures and isolate specific models per region. You can choose from a, ra you can choose from a range of topographic anatomy sections like head and neck, abdomen, thorax, left upper lymph, and so on, for example. Here we'll start with the head and neck and construct the model by adding the related body parts such as arteries, veins, the nervous system, and many others. And there you go, there's your, your, your model that you're interested in readily. We can also view the other topographic anatomy sections and start subtracting, subtracting sections, either not, related, not directly related or of no immediate interest with the specific topography we want to examine. When you deactivate the topographic icon, and this is amazing, the constructed 3D model remains on your screen view, ready for further engagement with the functions, features, and tools that are available for you to use. This is great when you are creating your anatomy lesson plan, demonstration, or presentation. For example, the amazing intuitive search feature will allow you to, research, to search the entire 3D organon database and locate a certain structure that you're interested in finding. So if I type spinal cord, a whole menu of related structures drops in the option panel, allowing you to choose the ones you want. The brilliance lies in the fact that the selected structures automatically add on to your anatomy model. Here I've added the spinal cord, for example. To view, I can always re-enter the topic of anatomy model and continue construction the model. Here I've, can, I've added on um, the connective tissue in the topic of anatomy module, and I've even added on the spine from the skeletal system. It's absolutely amazing. You can always you can always exit the topographic anatomy again. You will find the model that you have continued to, um, that you last constructed ready there for any further engagement with any of the functions, features and tools. And you can always revert back to build more. Amazing when you're, for your, dem your, your de demonstrations and your, and your lesson plan. Here again, you can deactivate the topic and use features such as bone mapping with surfaces, parts, and landmarks, for example. We'll see this soon. Here I'm highlighting a vertebrae, and I've gone to the surfaces, parts, and landmarks. That's another, that's another uh, engagement that I've interacted with with my model. There are hundreds of these possibilities. So imagine the unlimited possibilities and tremendous power available to you when designing your lesson plan, demonstration, or presentation with your desktop or tablet. The diagram to illustrates a full mapping of all body systems and their structure classifications. At the full expansion of an anatomical structure, the entire breadcrumb navigation trail is shown together with the 3D model and its definition. And there you go. There's your super bone, for example. There are thousands, literally over 10,000 such structures that you could identify with your diagram. Regional anatomy allows you to explore anatomy based on regions of the body and emphasize the relations between various systemic structures. For example, muscles, nerves, arteries, and et cetera, in that region. 
The module consists of hundreds of pre-configured pre scenes of popular anat anatomy views. You don't have to build your anatomy model from the ground up, but instead you can choose the readily available predetermined model based on the body part you are interested in. We just saw the, the skeletal system. Here's the muscular, muscular system with tens of, of pre-configured uh, muscle 3D models. Here's the heart body system. Again, we're just scrolling through to give you an, an idea of what's available to you. A plethora of, of, of valuable resources. Here's the heart ventricles. Coronary circulation. Here's the heart itself. We've moved on to the nervous body system, the nervous system from our 15 body systems. Again, we're just scrolling through to give you an idea of what's available. Readily available, I should add. Here's the respiratory system, which is the lower respiratory tract. Here's an indicative model. Again, there's a, there's, by just clicking on a structure, you have the, um, the option panel drops and where you've had uh, a, an array of tools. We'll see those in detail in one of the next models. Here's your digestive system. A model from that, from your digestive system, I should say. Urinary system. Here I've opted to show you the, the, the female pubic region. Amazing detail. You can use a search function to add on, find and, and add on more um, structures. This is the mammary gland. This is, this is something close to my heart because, because of my background in medical imaging and uh, mammography. The sensory system here is the inner eye. It's amazing. For the purpose of today's webinar, we have taken pre, we have opted to take pre-configured 3D models and 3D scenes from the regional anatomy system, from where you just saw before, to demonstrate 3D organ on, on desktop and mobile. One of my favorite examples and I tend to show this, is a cerebral arterial cycle, also known as the Circle of Willis. We all know that the Circle of Willis is critical as it's the meeting point of many important arteries supplying blood to the brain. However, structural differences in the Circle of Willis are common, and the classic complete anatomy of a Circle of Willis is in fact only apparent, apparent in a minority of cases. Therefore, explaining and understanding the Circle of Willis may be difficult, and this is where 3D organ anatomy with desktop or tablet and mobile devices can help. So let's select the circular widths from the nervous system and, and explore all the, the amazing possibilities. Then there it is, the circular willis. You can hover with your, your mouse and you get the um, identification of the structure. Very simple, you can scale, rotate, and position your model at the desired angle. You select and identify any of the thousands of anatomical structures from your 3D model, and the option panel appears automatically, providing you with the definition and anatomical terminology of that structure. Internal from the option panel, you have, it includes the sound function, allow, which allows you to listen to the anatomical terminology. The hide function, which allows you to just subtract structures from the scene and delve into the deeper layers of the model. It's like performing a digital dissection by hiding anatomical structures and venturing into the inner layers and structures of your model. And then again, when by press, simply pressing back, you can retrace your steps and return to your starting point. With the is isolate function, you can select the structure or structures and isolate them from the rest of the scene in order to examine from a close-up view. Look at this, They're absolutely amazing. We were able to do something very, very similar with the VR in our previous um, webinar, so keep that in mind. 
In the fade mode, you can demonstrate the whole body or specific structures in X-ray style, where you can make the structure semi-transparent to emphasize the location, borders, and relationships with other structures. We're just showing here some, um, demonstrating some of the um, things you can do with the fade and fade others um, mode. Ideal for your, both for your and, and, and lesson plan, for delivering your anat for the anatomy demonstrations, and of course, uh, delivering your presentation, anatomy demonstrations for a, at a conference for, or a congress, for example. With the catalogue images, you can explore hundreds of catalogue images familiarized with all body areas of systems and structures and reference them with the 3D models. You simply select a structure, identify and label it, and improve, and you can improve your understanding of anatomical structures. Here you can even add, insert your own annotations wherever you desire for, your for both your teaching and self-directed learning purposes. Students can familiarize themselves with common clinical correlations and manifestations organized in body systems. The module enables quick access to essential knowledge on a wide range of pathologies, according to the body um, uh, system we're examining. And that's only one anatomy model from the nervous system. We have 15 body systems in total with hundreds of such models. So just think of what you can do with all this anatomy content in your course, both as an educator and as a, as a, as a student in your self-directed learning efforts. The following video on the vertebral column anatomy is an excellent example of using 3D organ and anatomy with desktop and mobile devices for teaching and learning anatomy and in the study of orthopedics and osteology. We'll take the spine from the skeletal body system and we can identify vertebrae for a detailed and in-depth exploration examination for your teaching and learning purposes. Here's the, the, the option panel that's dropped again in front of us and we can get the definition, for example, of a structure. We can use other functions, features and tools. Here again, we're using the fade and fade others option to ex for that amazing X-ray style. Many vertebrae levels. For example, associated with significant anatomical landmarks and structures. You can demonstrate to students all parts of the skeleton in precise detail and quality by using the bone mapping to display fully selectable colored maps of the surfaces, borders, parts, and landmarks on each bone. The bone mapping model in 3D organ offers a detailed color mapping for each bone of the body organized, as I said, into parts, borders, surfaces, and landmarks. And the module details over three and a half thousand bone features and landmarks, which are presented with appealing colors and highlights. Absolutely amazing. With microscopic anatomy, you can present detailed anatomical models of important organs and tissues at a microscopic scale and in a very unique way. The 3D organ extensive database of full thickness 3D models enables a stratified histological analysis by providing a, de a true depth perspective and transforms teaching and learning into a highly efficient procedure. So let's take a closer look. Here are some um, characteristic scenes from our microscopic anatomy module. We'll start off with the amazing skin. There you go. You, to, you, to view the anatomical terminology of a structure during navigation, what you do is simply hover the mouse pointer over it and an annotation will show up, showing you the uh, labeling um, different structures in that microscopic anatomy model. Here's the liver lobule. Again, by simply just hovering the mouse, you're getting all the, um, 
um, anatomical terminologies and identification of, 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 of the structure. And here's the absolutely superb micro, microscopic ear model. And we still have some surprises for you in the 2020, 2022 edition that will be coming out shortly. Uh, before we move on, I would like to remind you that the 3D organ on microscopic anatomy is the only microscopic anatomy model module available in a VR platform in the world. We saw this in our last webinar, but I thought it would be nice just to give, uh, remind you. The human body actions module features over 550 real time animations of the joints, muscles, respiratory, cardiovascular, reproductive systems and sensory organs. So let's just take another closer look at this. Here are some characteristic examples of the literally hundreds and hundreds of, of uh, body actions that are available to you. Flexors of the elbow joint muscles, which have been taken from the muscular body system. Each movement performed by a muscle is displayed and labeled separately for that superior teaching experience. Here's the articularis genuine muscle. The respiratory mechanics, action from the respiratory body system. Again, one of hundreds that are available um, to you. Circumduction of the shoulder joint taken from the skeletal body system. The joints and muscle actions are especially effective for teaching and learning in physiotherapy and sports science courses, I'd like to add. That's great. I would have liked to have shown you the amazing heart body action too, but we're coming out with a new one soon. So I'm saving that for a, a surprise at a later date. I'm not going to spoil it now. With the formative assessment module, your students can test their knowledge in identifying anatomical structures with the clinical anatomy USMLE style interactive formative assessment. Here you can see, you can choose the body system you want the questions to, to um, derive from. It could be one body system, it could be multiple body systems. Here you can um, select the number of exam questions. You can even time yourself, you can set the timer, you can show the answers. Oh, answer options, not answers, like, di distract, di di like di um, distractions. And you simply start the quiz. The intuitive way the formative assessment is done is unique to 3D organ only. The quiz module of offers an innovative assessment method due to the requirement for students, the, re the unique requirement for students to have to explore the 3D model and then select the correct answer option. Here, when we were doing it, we were lucky enough to um, be correct. The analytics feature provides a history of your performance in past quizzes and allows you to gauge your progress and learn from your mistakes. Here again, it gives you a complete history, stored, st stored history of, of your performance in your past quizzes. The search feature is definitely one of the highlights of the many 3D organon features and functions. It is, it is highly didactic for your students and a most effective feature when creating your lesson plan and demonstrating anatomy to your students. To search the entire 3D organ database, simply click on the search tool on the left side of the panel. Here we've opted to search for the superior and inferior mesenteric plexus in our nervous system. We don't know where it is. We want to, so there it is. Oops, there it is. The same effect, the same application applies for when you use search feature for any other structure related to any other body system. Search is available on desktop, tablet, and mobile devices. 
Another amazing and very effective feature, especially when demonstrating anatomy in your class or presentation, is the multi-select feature. Let's choose the liver model from the digestive body system. Here we go. To select multiple structures and engage further actions in them, click, simply click on the multi-select icon on the left side panel. Here we see multi-selecting structures like the right and left liver lobes, the stomach and others. And we want to, to hide, for example. I can move further on. We can select the, hepat the hepatic bile ducts, the cystic ducts, the diodium, pancreas and other structures. And, and decide to further engage with more interactive um, features and functions. Here we've opted to engage with the, the, the fade mode feature to, to make the surrounding structures, structures semi-transparent and emphasize the location borders and relationships with other structures. Just look at this, this amazing effect. Imagine using this in your lesson plan, in your... Um, anatomy demonstration, and especially in your presentation. The possibilities are endless. 3D organ anatomy provides a range of tools that can easily be used in patient education, surgical training, creating your lesson plan, anatomy demonstration or presentation on your desktop, tablet, or mobile. We get to the tools. Here's the notes. Click on the notes icon from the tools section. You can click on one of your notes and you can read the text that you have already added. Remember we mentioned it earlier on too, in one of the examples. Click on the blue select structure icon and the anatomical structure that you have made a note will, will appear. Teach anatomy. Is, teaching anatomy is interrelated with drawing and explaining different concepts. You can use your featured drawing tool to sketch meaningful explanations to students laid on top of 3D models. He would use the heart model, for example. The growth tool is designed to help you demonstrate cancer and growth development and spreading directly onto the models of tissues and organs. Here we've opted to show you um, the growth tool in the abdomen, in the colon. You can even illustrate or demonstrate um, to the patient uh, multi micro calcifications um, in, in the breast. Uh, this is something very close to, to my heart because of my uh, medical imaging background. Simulate the effects of bone inflammation and osteoarthritis with the bone spurs toolkit. Here we're using the knee model, from, for example. The tool is ideal for clinicians who want to explain the mechanism of joint pain or swelling to patients, in this case in the knee, due to osteoarthritis. The pain effect tool helps you place colored glowing spheres at custom locations onto anatomical structures and organs. These effects are useful in demonstrating pain points during teaching and clinicians also favor this tool for patient education sessions and purposes. Simply reset and start on with another tool. With the slicing toolkit, you can section the 3D model from any angle you want in real time. Clinical and surgical procedures can be easily explained to students and patients as structures are cut away on a modular approach. Absolutely amazing. With the favorites mod function, you can save your models on quick, for quick access. So let's take a look at an example. From the heart body system, for example, let's take a look at the heart model and perform all the plan manipulations for our lesson plan demonstration. We're using all the tools that are available to us. Then we can save the favorites, the favorites function feature. This is a great way to prepare your 3D models, save them in favorites, recall the saved models and implement them in your lesson plan demonstration or presentation. 
There you go. We saved it. We did our manipulation, our model. We saved it for our presentation or, 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 or session purposes. And then we saved it and we recorded it. Of course, before we moved on, you can take snapshots for your, of, of your favorite scene. And you can also use the record function, which will help you create your digital anatomy presentations in teaching and training sessions. During teaching, it is essential that you maintain a smooth transition between demonstrations. Therefore, the viewing switching module in 3D anatomy enables smooth and agile transition between anterior, posterior, superior, inferior, and lateral views of the anatomy models. And you can also center any 3D model with the click of a button. 3D Organon has cleverly um, designed our application with its wide array of rich plethora of um, tools, features and functions, um, taking into consideration your every need and requirement. Let's take a look at this short video on 2021 edition of 3D Organ on Anatomy for Mobile Devices. The, the, the content on mobile devices is exactly the same as what we've explored so far on desktop and lap laptop devices. The only difference is the way it's viewed, the visualization, and that's only due to the um, feature, the characteristics and the features of um, um, the screen on tablet. But nothing else is compromised or lacking. And of course, our mobile and tablet software has integrated augmented reality where anatomy is superimposed onto your real environment. This is both very easy and super fun to do, especially for the students. I would like to emphasize that each year 3D Organon releases a new edition with amazing new models and features. We are only a few weeks away from releasing some exciting new developments, so I highly recommend that you stay tuned for the next webinar. To give you a sneak preview, the 2022 edition would include great new features such as the imaging module, um, as I said, the imaging model, histology slides, pathology images, refactored animations, new VR environments, and your new VR search tool. New microscopic models with absolutely beautiful graphics. Here we can see the multipolar neuron, the karyotic cell, and the new eye model with 97 different objects in the model. Amazing. And to save the best for last, the new ultrasound VR simulator for ultrasound simulation for educational ultrasound training. I won't say more. I'll save it for the next webinar. But we are we at Three Dogon are so excited about this and cannot show wait to show you show the world. So stay tuned. It won't be long now. As we speak, 3D Organ is being trans, trans, trusted by hundreds of top two universities worldwide in Europe, the United States, Asia, Australia, the Middle East, and so on. We look forward with an excitement to joining your institution also and making you a valuable and cherished member of the 3D Organ community. We provide a wide range of anatomy solutions to facilitate your every need and requirement, including um, anatomy software licenses and solutions for desktop, laptop, as we said, Windows, Mac OS, tablets, mobiles, um, across iOS and Android platform, and of course, seat licenses for professionals and seat licenses for students. Therefore, for any questions, more information, technical consultation, demos, training sections, se sessions, sorry, and to get your free trial of the 3D Organ Anatomy software solutions, please feel, please feel free to visit our website at www.3dorganon.com or contact us at prosupport at 3 dorganoncom and my colleague, Christina, and myself, I'm Theo, and we'll be more than happy happy to get in touch with you straight away and, and with, with assistance. I would also like to emphasize that 3D Organon, we do not take customer support lightly. So George at our customer support team is always keen to offer his assistance and support whenever needed and in a timely fashion. 
Well, you can always get in touch with us and, we, and we, we, with any questions and information that you need. And we're more than happy to um, assist you. Once again, thank you very much for, 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 for being here with us tonight. Stay safe, healthy and well. And we hope to see you very soon for our next webinar on um, um, the 2022 edition. Thank you very much and take care.